What's going on, guys? It's your girl Janiqua A, and I am back with another video for you guys, okay? So, we're gonna jump right into it. I'm hoping all of you guys are doing well. And we're gonna see what spirit has in store for you. I was also getting someone needing to be um, embracing at this time their own individuality, like embracing their uniqueness. So you have the chariot. Someone is moving forward in victory. You guys have completed and overcame a really, really tough challenge recently. This challenge that you guys were able to overcome required a lot of willpower and strength. It requires your spirit. Also, I'm seeing that you guys left a lot of things behind. Some of you guys are moving. Some of you moved away from your home. Some of you guys left jobs. And you guys are not looking back. When you're in a chariot energy, you're not looking back. You guys left because... You went to follow your dreams here. You guys are pushing forward in victory with your dreams, with your aspirations. Something has sparked your heart and your desires here. And I see you pushing forward. Some of you guys also upgraded your vehicle. Some of you guys moved to a new house. But you moved to follow your dreams. And what you love. So you moved away from things what, that were bringing you heartache. And you chose this time to heal. You moved forward in victory. You overcame any battle when it came to your heart and your relationships. You overcame a lot of blockages. When it came to um, certain situations that involved your emotions and your heart. And that's why this page of cups is here, because you decided to move forward with your dreams and things that you really loved and put on the back burner because you couldn't physically and mentally process a lot of things in the past. So you had to take time to really rejuvenate and gain the strength and the spirit and the willpower to move forward. Because again, the chariot, the chariot moves off of their willpower and their mental and their strength and their ability to move forward through any adversity or challenges here. You got the Ace of Cups. So you see, you move forward and you got over anything that was moving or holding you back. There was a, there was a, a battle that you just overcame and it took a lot of strength and willpower. It took a lot of you releasing Things that wasn't serving you no more and that was really having a strain and a blockage and hindering your growth. This place or this thing or this relationship that you left caused you pain time and time again. And it was really having a heavy effect on your heart. And when your heart is hurt and not healed, you, you tend to make bad decisions because you are operating at a lower level um, chakra here. But you chose to move forward and really go after your dreams. Your dreams is deficient in the cup. You chose to tap into your spiritual gifts or your spirituality and connected with your inner child and your higher self here. You've chose to move forward with your dreams and aspiration and something that was way more fulfilling than this heartache. You chose to heal from this. And you use these swords that cause you a lot of emotional discomfort as wisdom that you can now use now as you move forward. That wisdom is going to bring you a full whole cup of love, which is gonna allow you to experience the highest form of emotional fulfillment. This is you moving forward to people, places, and things that are attracting the same high vibrational frequency here. You will no longer experience heartache as long as you stay obedient, obedient and keeping your cup full so you can always have enough to heal others. 
so you can always have enough to go after your dreams and aspiration and never feel depleted is what i'm getting so you can always have enough inspiration and love and strength so you can always push forward through any adversity that the universe may throw at you to test you this is spirit handing you a gift for all your hard work through the challenges that you recently experienced that you had to overcome some of you guys by yourself some of you guys didn't really have a support system and this is another another reason why you are being gifted from the universe an overflow of love this could be um to yourself this could be unconditional love or this could be a new partnership or just mending family issues but the key here is the chariot you have that you have and you are surrounded by the strength and the ability and the mental capacity to move forward and whatever it is that has been straining on you at this time you have the strength and the ability to again to really blossom and go after all your dreams and aspirations so this actually was a blessing in disguise because this heartbreak or this heartache or the severage of friendships and family this caused you to really heal what needed to be healed and that will actually clear your mental that will actually allow you to see things for what they are and what is true and then that is how you replenish yourself you replenish yourself by making a commitment to take accountability and mending your own heart follow your dreams and what makes you happy and continue to move forward and learn learn yourself learn your 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 wants and your don't wants learn um your do's and your don't do's learn your light and your dark Learn what actually triggers you and what don't. So now you're in this Queen of Cups energy. Now you're actually in tune with your emotions. You had to grow. You had to really figure things out. Again, what you did like, what you don't like. What is actually going to bring you the abundance you need rather than relying on materialistic things all the time. This is you diving deep into your heart and again, your soul. And realizing all the opportunities and the the creativity that you hold within yourself and not choosing to stay in this three of swords energy which is heartache grief sadness discomfort and dis-ease this is someone that's chosen has chosen to receive the blessings that come at them on a daily basis and to look at things as a learning lesson and all things and knowing that everything happens for a reason and when you look at things like that your heart heals and you begin to experience again this overflow of emotional fulfillment here things are not only about material things here this is about you gaining wisdom and knowing how to use your heart correctly and now you are in this queen of cups energy back on your throne tapped into your emotions you have this big holy grail right here so now you have two now you are able to have complete control over your emotions and you can give freely now because you're not depleted. No one is sucking you dry and making this overflow of love dry out. No one can do that no more because now you have to. You are fully in control of your love and your support and your energy that you give and receive. All right? At the bottom of the deck, that is going to lead you to the most happiest and harmonious and a life that is filled with compassion, a, fill, a family that is uh, filled with strength and unity. And the goal here out of the cups, and this is all cups, is to move forward. Spirit has worked on your heart chakra here. It's literally all cups. And the major arcana is the chariot, which is moving forward in victory. You have succeeded in a cycle of learning what love is and what you have to do to get this unconditional love that everyone yearns and craves. And the first thing is healing. When you heal, you learn, and then you refill. And when you refill and you learn, you master. And when you master and you learn, everything sticks and magnetizes and you begin to use your mind more so as a steering wheel rather than your ego that's what i have for you guys i love you